Yo, hey land hunters, what is up? Today we have a new bingo fall. So this is just going to be a quick video. So I'm going to give you some quick tips on how to clear some of them much easier. So some of them can clear together. For example, the first one, this Durando thing. All right. So to get this Durando thing, um, you have to clear this ancient. Uh, the ancient claw beast tower so as a reward you can see from these pictures yeah so uh, from the rewards from the beast tower once you hit a certain points you get those items right so do not sell them because you will need it to clear one of the bingos uh, but basically you just need to equip them uh, in your secondary you don't have to change into it just use it and it will count as a clear and so moving on to the next few bingos, right? most of them is pretty straightforward like exchange 10 times, use gold potion 4 times or defeat this 10 times, defeat that 5 times. All right? But the most important one is this Xylent because it is not yet released as a behemoth but you can find Xylent in the story quest. All right? So this is where you find them all right? in uh, this Dragon, Dragon Plateau uh, in both normal and hard mode. At the final maps, you can find Xylent, all right, here. Uh, yep, so here in this picture, I have already highlighted it. So if you do not know, you can access hard mode once you clear normal. Uh, yeah, so as I pointed out here, uh, on the top left corner, you select it, and then there's this option where you can choose to go hard mode. And yep, so I recommend going to using hard mode instead of fighting the one on the normal because the normal is level 150 while the level 300 on the hard mode is tanky enough for you to fight it normally without having to specially uh, equip your spear to do the onslaught on it. It's tanky enough for you to fight for the average player to fight normally with your friends to hit it 250 times to cast your magi to do 80k damage and also with your durando equip on one of your secondary slots yep so yeah try and clear and unlock the hard mode yep, that's my advice for that bingo okay so moving on right so the next few tips uh for easy quality of life all right uh it's pretty straightforward quite a uh, complete 20 cute favors well so you just go to ask favors uh yeah so accessing that you can choose a bit more and then just well just do this 20 times or if you're impatient use gems unlock more slots and you can clear it faster and for this uh few bingos right they uh, as of now of this video they have yet uh, to be released in global so you have just gotta wait for them to come out with the new events for Xylant uh, expeditions and the new chapter quest all right so the rest well uh, it's pretty straightforward fiery you know, the burn ailments the magi ceiling types like uh yeah so fiery ail ailments like off the top of my head pro probably gunky ivata ivate um the those behemoth that burns you like maybe even wukong you know uh yeah so you can just give it a try or if you can search online someone already released uh a list of behemoth that uh inflict all these ailments so uh, magi ceiling those that paralyze you uh and then now to the next one which is this the enhanced magi 10 times which is pretty easy but the related one to it which is this one great success on magi enhancement how do you actually achieve this is basically it's a lucky chance where you get a 1.5 time boost in uh, extra experience to enhance your magi so this is probably a bit rng so praise to rng jesus for it um yep so and then the rest is pretty straightforward like i said that do 50,000 damage to a bakaron this yeah just use a magi just blast a bakaron okay okay and so the next one that uh, is really you can find it in the shadow quest which is the Zaran yeah uh, Zaran you can easily find it and kill them uh, like for example this yeah you can hit 250 times find a friend equip a spear stab it 250 times and you will have this cleared or blast it with magi um, what 
I can suggest with this is because the next uh, few one which is at Q 50 behemoth with a great sword and the spear yeah so defeat 50 behemoth using spear defeat 50 behemoth using great sword there is a way that you can clear this faster so you don't have to kill 100 which is equipping your spear as a secondary so i'm not sure if this is a bug or this is intended but you don't have to change to spear as long as it is equipped in your secondary the kill will still count but take note but this does not work for the great sword the great sword you have to deal damage you have to kill with your great sword if you one shot with a great uh, great sword using a magi for example if you're climbing the tower all right and you kill a behemoth using your magi it will not count so and because of that you can see why i have a 4 out of 50 for my great sword and 5 out of 5 for my spear <laughs> because i accidentally killed uh, behemoth in a tower using magi without hitting it with my great sword so it doesn't count and yes so you can use this setup like what i have uh if you don't have to go for exactly the same so you can use a great sword um with a spear equipped in one of those secondary slots that you're not using And yeah, so these are just some quick tips uh, that I've tested since I woke up and yeah, this is just a, a short video of some quality of life advice tips that I can give you uh, to, you know, clear the bingo much easier. Now, just try and clear some of them together if, you're po if possible because it, it just really cuts down the, the time you need to spend grinding out some of this. Uh, bingo all right so uh, I've come to the end of my video so if this has helped you in any way I would appreciate it if you leave a like and if this is something that you like please subscribe to the video uh, subscribe to my channel and I would greatly appreciate it so yep good luck hunting Hayland hunters see you around ciao